What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, AJ Got Kicks, back at it again with yet another shoe video. And today, man, I got the call, man. I, if y'all watched my last video, y'all know that finish line, um, and I think JD Sports too, they was doing like, you know, last late shipment in for the UNC ones. I know we're done talking about UNC ones. It seems like we can never get away from these UNC ones. But anyway, so they had a late shipment. And you know, like I said, um, if y'all ain't watched the last video, my friend, he was in the mall. He was able to see a raffle. He hit me up. I went to the mall ASAP and I uh, did a raffle and they said, okay, you're gonna get a call by Friday. Just if you want the shoes. I got the call after I made the video and posted that. So I'm so happy. So we're gonna head to the mall. We're gonna pick up another pair of UNC ones. Um, get a little, you know, a little vlog action. Y'all know every side of that come with the vlog action. We're gonna get this um, UNC ones from finish line. And you know, hopefully we gonna see if I can get another pair. I, I wanna get another pair. Um, Cause you know, y'all know the resale market going crazy. It's great trade bait, great trade bait. And um, and all that good stuff, man. So let's head to the mall. Let's pick up my shoes. Uh, make sure you like, make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe. I appreciate y'all for 100 subs. I really appreciate y'all, but let's get it. So let's go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, man. Shout out again, Finish Line, for letting me, you know, scoop up another pair of these things. I really appreciate it. I know y'all tired of seeing this, uh, you know, University Blues over and that, because that seems like all we're talking about, just over and over and over again. So I won't, you know, bore y'all with the review and then like that. I'll let y'all see it real quick, though. Um, you know, let's see if we got any, like, you know, glue stains or nothing like that. Um, on this pair, you know, I don't really see nothing. I don't really see nothing, man. This is so buttery, bro. This is such a good quality shoe. Such a good quality shoe. Toe box is kind of tumbled on this pair. Um, you know, check your pairs because some pairs are not as tumbled as others. Some pairs like really bad glue stains on like the toe box of the shoe. Um, everything looks good though on this pair. Y'all seen a whole bunch of this, so you know I ain't gonna bore y'all. Um, but I, but look, like I like this. Like, look. You see how they got the the little ticket? So basically, like they pull your ticket, they put your ticket in like a little box. For some of y'all who are not familiar with the in-store raffles, they put your ticket, um, you know, in a little box, and they pull out tickets to match the size. So I guess if they have like, you know, let's say they have four size nines, they're gonna pull in the box so they get, I guess, the four people that wear the size nine, and they're like, okay, well these are the four people that I want, you know. So I like this system. Um, it's way better than the first come first serve because first come first serve, you're gonna have people line up since like 7 a.m. or 8 a.m. or 9 a.m. and not, you, you don't, you don't really want all that. So you rather just, you know, do install raffles. Um, but the only downside to install raffles is, you know, you can easily backdoor the pairs because you're not letting the consumer or the customers know how much, you know, pairs you have. You just say, yeah, we got stock in. So what people are thinking is like, you could sell, you know, some pairs to the, you know, to the customers. So people will know that you, you know, you had an install raffle, but you can backdoor the rest of them. Like no one will ever know. So there's really pros and cons to this. If you have an install raffle, I'm saying like, don't keep half the stock for you and your employees and backdoor. Like, you know, let us pick up the shoes. Cause you know, y'all already worked there. Y'all can literally, if y'all want to as an employee, get every single release, I'm pretty sure. Or at least 85, 90% of the releases if you really want to. So, you know, let us get a chance to get it for retail. That's just, that's just my thing. Um, but yeah, so make sure everybody, y'all, make sure y'all call y'all JD Sports, y'all Finish Line, y'all Hibbit, y'all DTLR, and I don't know if I'm missing anything. Um, Jimmy Jazz as well. Make sure you ask them, what are they doing with their pairs when they actually do come in? Are they gonna do first come first serve? Are they gonna do like another raffle system? Are they gonna, you know, or, you know, what are they gonna do? Um, because you don't wanna be caught, you know, slipping. Like this shoe, 
on March 22nd, when they come out on the Flex apps, you know, your Foot Locker, Foot Action Champs, uh, check out my last video. Um, yeah, they're doing one more, one more chance uh, on the Flex app. So check out my last video. But basically, like after that day, and after they, you know, get the little, the last little stores, get their last little pairs. These, the price, whatever that is, is gonna be the lowest it's ever gonna be. And it's not gonna be no 340, 350, 360. It's gonna be, you know, close to that $400 range. And from there on, every single day afterwards, it's gonna go a couple dollars. Every single day, I promise you. Cause this shoe, a lot of people saying it's Jordan 1 of the year. Um, the Hyper Royals got something to say about that. But you know, this shoe, I mean like, y'all y'all seen this a whole bunch of times. This shoe is a crazy shoe, crazy colorway. Um, people are going crazy for this shoe. Gray school pairs, so you got a gray school pair of these, man, you might as well just put your closet in weight. And then a few months down the line, make your $500 or, or whatever is gonna be in a couple months. Um, man, men's sizes too. Whatever size you got for retail, I suggest to, to hold on, unless you, you, know, you just want the extra cash. Um, but yeah, man, make sure y'all call your malls because they might have some. I got this from Finish Line. So if that, my Finish Line is doing it, who knows what y'all Finish Lines are doing. Um, but anyway, I really appreciate y'all. I really appreciate the 100 subscribers, man. I really appreciate it. You know, we're on the road to 150 now. We're on the road to 150. So the only way I get there is if y'all hit the like button, y'all comment down below, y'all turn on post notification bells, and y'all subscribe to the channel. It will really help the channel out, and it really help me get to my goals. And you know, like I said, bro, 2021, we are bringing the bangers every single release. Y'all know this. Y'all know this. Every single release. But you know, regardless, man, I made it got kicks, and I got it right here. And we out. Money might walk. I just might pull up in robes. Chop will make you hit the wall. Shining got eye when I'm high, so they low. I ain't no Cherokee, but I told Pose.